Hey YouTube, thanks for spending the time to check me out. Um, yeah, I got my Space Marine order, and I wanted to make a video before I got too far into it. Um, what I got was one commander, one command squad, command squads right here. Um, and a battle force, and uh, I, uh, I can't find the case, but I got a, an extra rhino to go with everything. Um, what I have so far is two tactical, this is total, this isn't what's in front of me, this is just total. Um, so far I have two tactical squads, a combat squad, a terminator squad, two rhinos, a command squad, eight scouts, uh, and a commander. Oh, and back here I have some, uh, some little things. I have one sergeant, and I guess I could sub this guy in for a scout. I've already made a video about him. Two Vanguard veterans and some servitors that I gotta wait till I get a, uh, tech marine to use. So, um, yeah, I'm really happy. I got my order from Games Workshop. Thanks, Games Workshop. Ah, uh, not Games Workshop. Man. Ah, uh, it's this really great company out of, uh, Toronto, I think, in Canada. It's called Mini Wargaming. They're really great. I mean, I kind of waited a little long for my, uh, order to come in. I didn't mind that after I got it, though. And they sent me Mike and Ike, so. Anyway, um... Uh, so, my last video I told you I'd do uh, a tutorial or a review, and uh, it, instead of being on this Necron Heavy Destroyer, I'm going to do my scout, because I, I, I'm in the mood, I've just been building for the past maybe two hours or three hours, actually, like four hours actually, so I'm... Um, this is my Space Marine Scout. It's winter terrain, so as I, I'm gonna make all of these guys winter terrain. So I went with the winter camouflage scheme, and it's all, it's basically, I painted the body like I would a regular Space Marine Scout, and then I did a really, uh, almost an ink of white over the entire body, and then I dotted it with, um, actually, I made little slashes on the body of blue, and dotted it with chaos black. The blue I used was regal, but you can really use any kind of blue, or even mix it. Um, for the face, I did a camouflage green pattern. And, uh, for the back, that's my favorite part. It was just some empty space you could paint. My favorite kind. I can't wait to get to these rhinos. Anyway, um, I looked up the Games Workshop FAQs and the tutorials on how to paint camouflage. And I went with the, uh, the triangle pattern with white dots on the triangles and black, chaos black dots on the triangles and it, it turned out really nicely the base is just some um, rubber ground rubber it's uh... i bought it from games work not games workshop actually it's um... Gale Force 9, actually. I didn't even know I had, I had Gale Force 9 products. Wow. Um, yeah. Oh, oh, also, in my Games Workshop, uh, mini wargaming order, I ordered two paints, two brown paints to do a black, to paint the black based guys. They're called Reaper Paints, and I can't wait to use these. I've heard all sorts of good things about them. And I got leather brown and earth brown and oh, I can't wait.
can't wait to start painting. I just need to get some spray paint. And, uh, I got some transfer sheets, yeah. Now, there's a great website out called Bell of Lost Souls. And some of you may have heard of it already, some of you may not have, but it's a really great website. It's bellofloststouls.net. If you've listened to 40K Radio, I, I'm sure you've heard of it. And if you go on there, if you go into the archives, or if you go, if, I think they have a search bar. If you search um, transfer sheets, they'll give you the layout for like uh, the, the banners you can put on this, and all sorts of things, but, uh, and it'll tell you how to make them, it's, it's great, I, I just, oh, so many great things are coming out this summer with Planet Strike, and, uh, it's, it's gonna be a good summer for me, and, um, that's it, I'll talk to you later, YouTube, see you later.